Hello everyone, it's Nitin here. So, in this watercolor tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate uh, one of the very interesting place uh, in India in terms of uh, tourism, in terms of uh, the cultural heritage and the value. Uh, this is called uh, Kerala. Uh, Kerala is a southern part of uh, in India and a very attractive place uh, you know you can experience the nature you know uh, the backwaters and a lot of uh, uh, exciting things there and uh, it's typically known as uh, God's own country uh, so I, I also visited uh, several times to this place and uh, I really enjoyed uh, I really enjoyed making art there and uh, and overall experience was quite good so i really wanted to you know uh, bring that experience here and uh, i'm going to make one uh, one of the scene from from there from the backwater and the houseboat uh, you know um, and the palm tree if you want to support me and my art and uh, if you want to see yourself uh, you know uh, receiving a lot of uh, watercolor tutorial every week then please go ahead and uh, take a subscription of my patreon you know membership it's less it's it's just about uh, you know uh, five dollar a month uh, which is uh, which is incredible isn't it <laughs> but yes it's a beautiful way to support an artist so thank you so much everyone you can also check my skills here classes in video description i've given the link the port the surface level will be this so I'm just, uh, you know, <clears throat> segregating this two part. One is, this one is more like a landscape and sky. And uh, rest of the below part will be my, you know, uh, the the uh, water, right? So this is what uh, is composition. And uh, we'll start making, uh, sketching uh, the subject. So, this is the very wonderful houseboat. I don't know how many of you visited this place. It's very exciting, very, very, you know, mindful. Uh, you know, experience staying in these houseboats. Um, so we just need to make this uh, drawing. So there is a couple of people. So these people are like in the front. They are actually the ship uh, like now this boat uh, driver I would say and uh, yeah some life-saving things there so yeah so we don't want to make uh, too much of detail here it's just impression okay and uh, as I mentioned, so this is our the the level of water, backwater, and uh, you can just make a uh, few houses. Though it's very exciting to see the local house there, kind of cottage, right? 
and a uh, lot of greenery because uh, uh, Kerala gets a lot of rainfall especially in the monsoon season it's like a lot of floods most uh, a couple of couple of year back they were very devastating flood so we are just giving an impression of these palm trees right right nothing detail or anything so this is uh, so let me again introduce you to my color plate so here i'm using ultramarine blue sap green yellow ochre bunciana orange sepia red and uh, somewhere i'll be using black right so now let's go and uh, work on this sky mm -hmm. so i'm using this ultramarine blue and uh, I want to mix a little bit of yellow ochre so now you can see the your pigment of the ultramarine blue got changed and just pour here and take a quarter and just a little bit of like that If you want to add a little more depth there in the top, you can do that. So again, I have taken this ultramarine blue and a little bit of burnt sienna and just here a little bit. That's all. So there's a lot of water in my brush and now I'm taking this ultra sorry uh, sap green and again mixing with yellow ochre it's too contrast so I don't want that much of green and uh, just here and there so I'm just leaving this space for the boat and a uh, little more ultramarine blue and giving a little depth here and there sorry it's not a river it's a backwater and just gently pull it down just merge it okay yes so this is our first layer nothing much on this you should be happy with this and uh, let it dry and uh, once this gets dry we'll go for the next layer so now we have uh, completely dried paper and uh, we can go ahead uh, doing the second layer so just 
just get in there. And here also there has to be very prominent. Just deafness here and there. And uh, we have to give a lot more depth. in this section Effect. We want to give a little more water. So it, I'm mopping a little more color on top of this. see here And uh, yes, <laughs> so yeah, so we got it. So I hope uh, you understood the, the water reflection. More important is uh, you need to be very agile. Just don't think about the end result. It just need, you need to go through whatever the uh, things comes in your mind, whatever the color you are picking. Just enjoy that and just put it there without any thinking, without much analysis you know the people are starting doing a lot of analysis about what will happen how it will happen and all that so this uh, you know remove that that part and uh, i'm just building 2020 and uh, i hope you got something from this and uh, uh, if you if you can just uh, you know work on this work and upload in the community section that would be really great i'll be able to give you some suggestion and feedback if you want and uh, thank you so much thank you so much everyone for your wonderful support and uh, i will be coming with a new video very soon take care and uh, enjoy your watercolor journey thank you Thank you.